Well, uh, Jean-Emile, what a remarkable story here today for the opening stage of this Tour de France. As you said, uh, it's uh, Britain, Adam Yater, who uh, is the first rider to wear uh, that iconic yellow jersey after coming out on top of a very uh, dramatic battle with none other than his twin brother, uh, Simon Yates, after this very, at the end of this very tough, very hilly 182-kilometre route around uh, Bilbao. It's a first Tour de Stage win for 30-year-old uh, Adam. Uh, Yates, uh, the, the pair, the two brothers going toe-to-toe. -to -toe. They really created a big gap with the last uh, kilometre to go from uh, the other riders, uh, hoping uh, to win today's uh, opening stage. Uh, they went all the way to a sprint finish, those two uh, twin brothers, but it was Adam who was uh, in the driver's seat. He did give a quick look, though, to see exactly where his uh, brother was. It's not actually the first time uh, that uh, brothers have achieved a 1-2 victory uh, at a stage uh, on the Tour de France. It actually happened back in 2011. It was uh, brothers Andy and Frank uh, Schleck, though I do think you'd have to double-check this, that it's the first time that twin brothers have achieved uh, such a feat on the tour. Um, Tadej Pogacar, obviously one of the big uh, race favourites uh, ahead of uh, the, the Tour, uh, finished in third. He had to sprint for that third uh, place uh, with uh, a group of other riders. He picked up some uh, important sprint uh, points along the way. And most importantly, the UAE Emirates rider is four seconds ahead of his big rival, uh, Jonas uh, Vingegaard. A very difficult stage here today, especially for uh, the Tour's uh, sprinters uh, in this race. And a very, very bad day for Ricard Carapaz, uh, who finished 15 minutes behind uh, the race leaders here today. That was uh, after a fall also involving his teammate Enrique Massa, who's actually pulled out of the Tour de France. And that's Enrique Mas uh, from Spain, Selena. So uh, Spanish hopefuls are uh, not doing too well on that first day. But of course, it is a big day for Bilbao itself. How has the city received the Tour de France? I would say very well, Jean, uh, even from the very early hours of this morning when we were following the route, uh, you could already see a lot of people gathering here, a lot of them with uh, Basque flags. It has to be said that you can really... Uh taste the, the pride of the, the region and also just that them having hosted this only for the second time, the Basque region only hosting the Tour de France uh, for the second time. As per usual, obviously a very uh, festive atmosphere. It's this festive atmosphere that the Tour de France is uh, so uh, famous for. Lots of big crowds along the way and especially uh, here, of course, uh, at uh, the finish uh, line. Um, and I can think we can expect more festivities uh, tomorrow. Obviously, uh, the race continuing uh, here in the Basque country with a 290 kilometer a stage two uh, finishing in San Sebastian.